ARS is in its fourth season, um, but we've been partnered with Airtel for, for two years now. Um, we've got a further year to go next year on our, on our deal. Um, I think we've, we've really kind of, we've, over the last couple of years, we've really taken the partnership on. Um, this particularly has been one of the best things uh, to come out of that partnership. I think now doing a five day clinic and then also coaching coaches after that. Um, it's given us a kind of a real variety and we've, we're looking at really helping grassroots football in Africa in a different way. Um, I'm very excited to come out here at Rwanda to, to work with a good quality level of players. Um, yeah, it's been very encouraging so far, you know, you, you've seen a lot of different kind of um, age groups on, um, from 13 up to 17. Um, but it's good quality all around and everyone seems to have a good, good laugh, good fun. But they're working very, very hard during the session as well and match time you can see that they are reaping the rewards of them playing, working hard during the day. Yeah, so it's been very, very good so far. Day two was today was focused on player development, so we looked into doing how socially, um, psychologically and also technically as well as looking at the four corners of the FA. Um, so looking at how physically as well, so physically how you develop as a player, what's important, so if you can talk about being strong, being fast, being quick. Socially how it's important is to be important for your teammates to be friendly and also sociable. Um, Technically, looking at skills so like passing, dribbling, moving, etc. And psychologically, looking at how you prepare for the game before you start, looking at how you, how you think to beat a defender to out, outdo them during the game or match situation.